Independent Country Hall of Fame inductee Bobby Mackey opened Bobby Mackey's Music World back in the 1980s. He sat down with Cincy Lifestyle's Michaela Hughes Shaw to talk about his career in his legendary honky tonk <laughs> and what is still in store in his own words. I love those wide open spaces. I'm hey, I'm Bobby Mackey from right here in Wilder, Kentucky. I've been playing music here for 45 years and, and holding. I come down here from Lewis County, Kentucky, up near Vanceburg. Out of high school, I come down here and, and got a job on the railroad. You know, I brought my guitar with me, so music was never very far away from me. And while I was working on the railroad on Sundays, I would attend jam sessions in the area. Every nightclub around here had a jam session on Sunday. My dad had it all planned out for me to go to college. Graduated from high school and the summer was going by and I didn't know what I was gonna do because I knew I didn't wanna go. Finally cornered me, said, you need to start getting ready, to, you know, making your plans to go to, go to Moorhead here. And I wouldn't even look at him. I looked down like this. I said, Dad, I don't wanna go. <laughs> Scared to death. Then I looked up and said, I want to play music. <laughs> I had the opportunity to get into music full time, and I did that. My mom, she taught me to sing a song before I can even remember it. I'm from the old school. I play traditional country music. Hank Williams Sr. inspired me when I was four years old. And when I first heard him sing, it changed my life forever. All roads led to Wilder, Kentucky. <laughs> I played over a period of eight years in the tri-state area, just north of Cincinnati here, at three different nightclubs. And every time I'd leave one and go to the other, everybody would follow me. So it come to a point where I thought I should get my own nightclub. Great friends of mine that lived here in Wilder, they enticed me to come and look at this old gambling casino, the Latin Quarter that had been closed down for a long time. I was hooked when I saw this place. It just, it just felt so right. You know, the, the atmosphere has always been great. Uh, you know, we've come in here and, you know, put some new carpet in, cleaned and, and did some painting, and here we are 45 years later. My wife, Denise, has repainted this logo on this dance floor probably five times, and, and they just keep dancing it off again. <laughs> country music has gone away. Country music is not country music anymore. And I, I wrote a song, uh, what they call country is not country, they just stole the name. Lord, I love to hear the classics, and it's a crying shame. But what they call country is not country, they just stole the name. And that's what we're always going to play and the, we've wait, weeded out the people who don't like country music if they come here they gotta like country music. and lots of young people too and i love that you know that gives me you know that, that gives me energy right there uh every friday and saturday night I, I do nearly three hours every friday and saturday night when break time comes i, I want to keep singing you know? right through mississippi with texas weighing heavy on my mind Stop for a while in Louisiana. I've been inducted into the uh, Independent Country Music Hall of Fame. And independent don't bother me because if I was on a major label somewhere, they'd want to control everything I did. As an independent artist, I can record whatever songs I want to. Back in the day with all the, the, the older country music heroes that I always looked up to, what they had to lean on was country music radio. And country music radio has about dried up. YouTube has taken the place of country music radio. People don't have to listen to the radio to hear what they want to hear. They can go to YouTube and get it any time they want to. We've got a new record out called Anita, You're Dreaming. We're getting an award out, out in Houston, Texas for a duet we did, which was a number one independent record called All I Need Is You, and, and we're receiving an award at the T Texas Country Music Hall of Fame. Anybody who wants to hear country music, I think they should come here, because I'm going to be here. I got the Merle Haggard Blues today.